is, um, are we good enough? Are we doing enough? You know, I mean, you always think, am I doing the right thing? That I am chief of sinners. My fear is that that will overflow to them. It's just blown by. And do I, do I really only have five or six more years with them? And that's, that's terrifying. You know, I think there's days for sure that I kind of look back and say, did I give the or into them at all today, <laughs> you know? Oh, well, what do I need to be doing differently? And what should I be doing differently? Or how can I do that differently? So often those insecurities write, write hard on you that you're, you're not doing enough. I love it that she can just teach us about God and also be like right beside us to teach us and help us whenever we need it. She's really nice. She does a lot of things for us. <laughs> Jane's giving? She's always there yeah. for me. Shopping. Anywhere from clothes <laughs> to grocery store, we always have a good time shopping. <laughs> she always says that I am almost her favorite because all of us are her favorite. Well, my favorite thing to do with her is to get close and just snuggle up with her. There's so much love, I like, I can't even say it. Like, <laughs> Ooh. Just really, really strong and I really just look up to her for it. When I'm sad, she, you know, makes me happy. I would say that she's the best mom ever that I could ever have and anyone could ever have because she's really nice. My mom's my hero. It's good to hear, you know, there's a lot of mom guilt and you don't always get, well, you rarely get that positive feedback, you know, so, so to hear it, it's just, it's reassuring. Probably the best Mother's Day gift I've ever had. I love you, Mom, and happy Mother's Day. I love my mom. I love you, Mom, and happy Mother's Day. I love you, Mom, happy Mother's Day. I love you all. Happy Mother's Day.